Well, hello guys, welcome back. I know. I We tried to play a game for you today. We did, but it's the worst fucking game in existence. It's the Exorcist game, and VR is the worst fucking game in existence. Shit control, shit everything. The only highlight, and I've already deleted the recording, was when, because it's so fucking bad and you get stuck everywhere, I got stuck in front of a decapitated priest on my knees in a confessional, and my head was right right there right there in his crouch so that was great i i got to see his priest ball up close and personal and so that was fucking awesome <laughs> and lucky was laughing his ass off and i'm just trying to windmill my hands and trying to get the fuck out of there and it just fucking sticks you in random places and all i can see is the package on this priest and i'm like give me the fuck out of here this isn't one of my fantasies and the stinger that was supposed to alert me to the horror of a decapitated priest in a pig's head came, like, way too fucking late, because this game's really broken. And Loki was just laughing his ass off, because all that ex-Catholic suppressed rage were working on getting it out in a um, healthy manner that doesn't involve hurting people or screaming into the microphone. The whole game recording was screaming into the microphone about what I thought, so we 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 didn't do that. One second, please. These fucking allergies. And as you can see, I'm wearing red lipstick because my black lipstick went missing and I heard a little fox giggle. So I know he took it. It's okay. He can have it if he wants. I really don't care. Lucky takes random shit from time to time and sometimes he brings it back and sometimes he doesn't. If he took it and it's his happy little joy, it's okay. Um, we were up super late last night because I asked Lucifer and Satan. I treat them separately, but I respect some people who see them as the same entity. Anyhow, I said, would you guys like for a theistic satanic Easter, would you like to have another ham? Because we got the two hams, and, and they're those tiny can canned ones. And of course they wanted it, and I said, would you like colored eggs? And... They wanted that too, but they didn't want me to work. I was like, I'll be up all night anyways. I never sleep. So we made another ham, and we boiled the other half dozen of eggs, and we're going to have eggs and ham today. And I said, I can, you know, I've got like canned brown bread. We can have that. And I saved that soda, remember? Because Mammon shamed me about buying it. I saved the soda. And we did everything in inverse. I lit Lucifer's candle last night. There's a little bit left today, so I have to remember to light the nubbin. And Loki's pleased because they've all agreed. I can offer it to one, but they can, like, all partake. It's just they know there's so many in this house. They they all have to share. It's a thing. And so I'll light his candle again today. We did everything in reverse. If they do dawn, we did the night before. And um, Satan was laughing because he says, you realize it's kind of like a Jewish tradition. I'm like, oh, be quiet. <laughs> and, you know, um, so we did it the night before. And we started the candy the night before, because I'm like, whatever would be sinful and wrong, as fun, as fun, we did it. So we had some jelly beans last night, and what else did we have, baby? I don't know. Uh, we had a mini peep. We had those mini peeps. They're so fucking tiny, guys. They're like smaller, you know, smaller than those eggs back there, so they're so fucking tiny. But we had a peep, and we had some jelly beans, so we'll have some more stuff today, and we made a strawberry shake out of the iced tea, which was interesting. You know, that quick powder. Um, so we did that for breakfast. And I'm going to make sure I eat so I don't get sick and just, like, nomming on candy all day. But we're going to do whatever we want. I found a Slenderman film that I'm going to skip through large portions of and watch out. And we did try to play The Exorcist for you. But the controls are so fucking bad in that game, guys. And you guys know I don't have the best temperament in the world. And I'm like as modious. I want stuff to work and I want it to work efficiently. When you give me controls that are that fucking bad, I will just lose my shit and start swearing about it. And then you stick in places and just having my head in the priest's lap, that was the fucking end for me. So, <laughs> something, something, priest, something. <laughs> so, yeah. That worked out really well. Loki thought it was funny as fuck, but I was like, nah, that's okay. I said, Satan deserves better than that. So if we find something satanic or demon themed today to play, it'll be fucking better than that dumpster fire. So I got rare back here. But we're doing good, and we're just, we're going to take it easy today because, um, 
there's there's still like a fair bit of traffic outside um yeah you wouldn't know we're supposed to be in lockdown because nobody's paying attention to it and uh my friends are smart enough to stay home but i know some people were going to defy stuff and go to church i'm like fine go get sick i really don't care at this point it's sheer stupidity and it's sheer magical thinking I love Odin, I love Loki, I love everybody I serve, but I don't expect them to protect me if I go out and I know how a contagion works and I go out and I expose myself. I will pray for protection if I have to go out, but if I go out willfully just to go out, I I know I'm putting my fate in my own hands. You know, the gods will do a lot for us, but they're not going to spare us if we do something intentionally stupid. I mean, if we have to go out, like if you're a first you know, first responder, or you're still working a store or factory or something, that is totally different. It's these willful assholes that should be at home that, you know, yeah, if you're getting, going to get zapped, you're going to get zapped. So, I hope you guys are having a good one. And I, I like this red, too, so this red's nice, too. So, we're just going to, you know, chill, and I wanted to make something for you guys and make it, you know, quick. We tried to make the exorcist even earlier before this but you know it just didn't work out and of course it's going to rain today so it's not like i'll be outside filming anyways i mean nobody knows what the law is now if i could be out filming if it would be considered necessary or would it be considered something for a 200 hundred dollar fine i'm like where the hell am i going to find the money for 200 hundred dollar fine so you know until we get the all clear we're going to play it safe so if you guys like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.